Welcome back to Honey's Cooking. In this video, we're going to be making a really quick dessert. It's great for breakfast, dessert, snacks. It's amazing. It's a one pan fudge cake. So here's our one pan, all of our ingredients. We're going to put them in the pan and cook it. Simple as that. Okay, so for this recipe, we're going to need two cups of flour, one and a half cups of sugar, half a cup of cocoa, one teaspoon, um, maybe a little under a teaspoon of salt, one and a half teaspoons of baking soda, one and a half teaspoons of vanilla, one and a half teaspoons of vinegar, one and a half cups of water, I just put mine in a cup, and then three quarter cup of oil. So our easy steps are, we're gonna put our ingredients in, step one, dry first, and then we're gonna add the liquid. So we're gonna put our flour, our sugar, cocoa, dump that in there, our salt, should have had that open but I didn't, so almost a teaspoon just like that of salt, those are for later, and our baking soda, here we go, I'm going to do it over this one just so I don't make a great big mess, so there's one, and a half, that, we're going to mix these together just throughout the thing, the dish, and then we're going to add our wet stuff to it. So now for the wet ingredients, I've got three quarter cups of oil in here. Our water's right here and we're going to add our vinegar and our vanilla to the oil before we add it into our pan. So one and a half, you want to be careful with the vinegar not to put too much of the vinegar because you don't want it to taste like vinegar, you just want a little bit in there to help it stay together. I don't know the science of exactly how it makes it stay together, but it works because that's how we make it and we've made it several times and it's amazing. There we go, vanilla for taste. And we're gonna dump this into here, just across it. I'm gonna mix these and then add the water in there and then we're gonna put it in the oven. Okay, we're gonna add our water. If you wonder why it's funny looking, this is not the color of our water. We added a little bit more vanilla because as you can see, we have imitation vanilla rather than the actual vanilla extract. So we added a little bit more for flavor. You can do that, you don't have to. So we're gonna add our water to get it nice and moist, that extra vanilla. And now we're gonna keep stirring and then we're gonna add it into our oven. Our oven is set at 350 degrees. All right, now we're gonna stick it into our 350 degree oven for 25 minutes. Okay, everybody, here is our cake. It is ready from the oven, as you can see. Now we're just gonna sprinkle some powdered sugar on it and it will be ready to go. Just like this. All over. How amazing that is. Can't wait to dig in. There's our final product, guys. Thank you for watching, and we hope you um, like this cake and that you keep watching for more great recipes. See you next time.